Hello guys, how are you today? Good to see you one more time. So basically today what we're gonna learn how to talk about your favorite TV program. Yes, that's correct, right? So for this class, we have a set of different questions, okay, to talk about your favorite TV program. But remember, these questions that you're watching right now, we won't answer them, okay? We're gonna create a paragraph totally different, okay? So remember, we won't answer. We want to create a paragraph. So here we go. My favorite TV program, okay? Let's go through the pronunciation of dif these different questions. Question number one, what's your favorite TV program? Question number two, what time and day is it on? Number three, who are the main characters? Four, who's your favorite character and why? Five, what's the program about? Number six, when was the last time you watched it? Number seven, what happened? And the last one, would you recommend it and why? So these are the two, four, six, eight different questions to talk about your favorite TV program. So let's go through the pronunciation one more time. What's your favorite TV program? What time and day is it on? Who are the main characters? Who's your favorite character and why? What's the program about? When was the last time you watched it? And next one, what happened? Would you recommend it? Why? So in question number two, okay, if you listen, okay, I was, I was doing some connection, okay, in these three words right here, okay? They, what they is wrong. La letra T se convirtió en una R, la S tomó a esta I, y esta T se convirtió en R y tomó el on, okay? So the pronunciation is, what time and day is it on? So that's the pronunciation, okay? And this one, okay, is another mistake uh, most of the people do when they are learning, okay? It's not characters, it's characters, characters, okay? C and H sounds like K. Esta C y H suena como una K characters, characters, okay? And the other one, okay, this one right here, okay, pronunciation is watched, okay? Al final hay como una T explosiva para esta pronunciación de este verbo regular en pasado, okay? When was the last time you watched, okay? Como termina una explosiva, una T explosiva, agarra el it, watched it, watched it, all right? La, es una T aquí, en pronunciación al final y agarra la, al it, watched it, watched it, okay? When was the last time you watched it? Okay, guys, so basically that is explanation about pronunciation and also alliation of some words. So let's continue. So with these questions, like I was telling you, okay, we won't answer the question. What we're gonna do is we're, gonna, we're going to create a paragraph, okay? Which is the next step of learning English. Mm -hmm. At the beginning, you answer the question. But now, at this level that you are now, if you've been following my videos, so you should be able to speak more and more. So no more sentences. Now is the time to create more paragraph, okay? So like the way that you did with my favorite relative, okay? So you remember the video by uh, my favorite relative? So yes, that was the first one, okay? The first paragraph that, that you were actually creating. Now this was the second one, which is about your favorite TV program. So let's go ahead and see how this, how this done. So if you see here, so this is my example for you, okay? How to create your favorite, pa your paragraph about talking about your favorite TV program. So check it out. Hi guys, my favorite TV program is CSI Miami. And this series is on every day at 8.45 p.m. So the main characters are Rachel, Catherine, who is the master in the criminal lab. Besides all the detectives and police officers in the series. My favorite character is a girl because is a girl because he is the best detective and he behaves like a psychologist. And about the program, it's about solving murders and catching different criminals that have committed felonies 
And the last time I watched it, the episode was about a girl that was kidnapped by a serial killer. So at the end, they busted the guy and put him in prison for life. And I really recommend this series if you like suspense, police officers, and detectives solving law and crime cases. So this is the way that we create, okay, a paragraph, of, paragraph talking about uh, your favorite TV program. So let me check it out here. So here, uh, there is a mistake right here when it says, uh, my favorite character is the boy. Okay, is the boy. Okay. Is Horacio. Okay, like that. I'm gonna put here, is Horacio. Okay, I'm gonna put it here. I'm gonna correct this right now, okay? Is Russia? Okay, that's cool, that's better. Now, now we're good. So I'm gonna read it for you one more time. So remember we're using these questions, okay, to create this paragraph, okay? So here we go, one more time. Hi guys, my favorite TV program is CSI Miami. And this series is on every day at 8.45 p.m. So the, the main character are Horatio, Catherine, who is the master in the criminal lab. Besides all the detectives and police officers in this series. My favorite character is Horatio, is Horatio, because he is the best detecting, he behaves like a psychologist. And about the program, it's about solving murders and catching different criminals that have committed felonies. And the last time I watched it, the episode was about a girl that was kidnapped by a serial killer. So at the end, they busted the guy and put him in prison for life. And I really recommend this series if you like suspense, police officers, and detectives solving law and crime cases. Okay, guys. So basically, this is the way that you create a um, paragraph talking about your favorite TV program. So remember, this is an example for you, okay? Where that come from? ¿De dónde vino eso? De esta serie de preguntas, okay, guys? So, sigan esta serie de preguntas, okay? Uh, pronounce them, and uh, when you finish, okay, go ahead and create your paragraph. Sigan este ejemplo, creen su párrafo, okay? Follow this example and create your own, okay, paragraph. And when you finish creating the paragraph, Okay, record an audio and listen to yourself. Okay, so that's the way that you're increasing speaking English more and more. Remember, practice, okay, makes the earth, makes experts. Okay, so that's the way that we learn English. And thanks for being with me here, learning English very easy, very simple. Okay, guys, um, this is the way that we do it. Okay, and I see you in the next episode. Okay, on the next video. Very easy, very simple. Goodbye.